Good morning, ESM. Hey, Uncle Richie here. It's Fist Pump Friday. Yes, where we recognize those students that showed professionalism, respect, involvement, diversity, and excellence. Right, Fort Block? Yeah. All right, so without a further ado, hey, have a good weekend. I may see you at the uh, home dump coming dance. All right, make sure we got face up, moonlight, starlight. I need you. Face up, moon. What, that's not how the song goes? Oh, my bad. <laughs> okay, here we go. Fist bumps. Woo! We got Peyton Hausler from Miss Corbett. Woo! We got Aaron Douglas from Miss Lorenzo. Woo! We got Brandon Begley from Miss Carucci. Woo! We got Lillian Pena from Mr. Gray. Woo! We got Gabriella Dare Bradley Brady from Nazia Salik. Grand Grats. Woo! Ronan Gerber from Miss Corbett. Woo! We got Alex Dehor from Tristan Henderson. Woo! Have a great weekend. Richie loves you. Good morning, ESM, and thank you, Richie, for bringing the energy to this we morning. We enjoy you every day. Today is October 1st. And? It's the final day of Spirit Week, unfortunately. So today we're going to go over what's to come today. But more on that after news and announcements. The town center in Fayetteville is coming soon. Panera will now have a drive through and a Chipotle will also be coming. This opens up a few new job opportunities for students, so make sure you apply if you're interested. Now, Mr. Avellino with some kindness news. Hello? Good morning, everybody. It's Mr. Avellino here. This year, I'm here to talk about a brand new award that we have. Thanks to the efforts of Brett Jeffrey and his family, they have donated $1,000 to us this year for four awards every single month. So we have $25 checks that are going out today to the following four people. From Mrs. Stoker to Madison Flom. For Madison is encouraging and supportive to both the teachers and classmates. She always has a smile and a helping hand. Madison is a person who makes you feel welcome and part of the team. From Mrs. West to Todd Durantini. Todd really helped out in a pinch. Mr. Ferris was out, and Todd helped upload a video presentation to our CHS homepage. He did this with such kindness and grace. Thanks so much, Todd. From Mrs. Karochi to Rihanna Butchko, Rihanna reached out to another student and offered her friendship and support. This act of kindness was very much appreciated by the student. You are an amazing role model, Rihanna. From Mrs. Corbett to Aiden Sherlock, this year on the very first day of school, Aiden selflessly brought in a case of water. Aiden is incredibly kind and is very deserving of the Kindness Award. And just last but not least, kudos to all staff and students. You had an amazing school spirit week. I love the participation. So go Spartans, let's go tonight and let's go for all the sports teams. Have a great day. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands one nation under God indivisible with liberty and justice for all the homecoming football game is on Friday October 1st at 6 30 p.m. reminder no backpacks will be allowed in the stadium also no outside beverages from students will be allowed in the stadium please remember to bring two dollars for admission I can't read that and three dollars oh two dollars for admission for students and three dollars for adults <laughs> so today, of course, is Orange and Blue Day, and it's the day of the pep rally. The pep rally will be taking, taking over fourth block as usual. The events this year are? Uh, we got a hula hoop competition. A potato sack race. Uh, the dizzy uh, PK, which is a penalty kick. Penalty kick yeah. uh, and now on to weather and sports.
girls varsity soccer team beat Auburn 6 to nothing last night. The team was led by Nat Natalie Pearson with two goals, one assist, and Leah Rem with two goals and assists. Alina Kurzik and Leah Shavesty both had one goal each. Al Angelina Paul Carroll and Jessica Griffith both had an assist, and Isabel Shavesty had her seventh straight shutout. The boys varsity soccer team beat Auburn 10 to nothing last night. Jackson Tedesco led the team with three goals. Ibrahim Hasukovic and Zach Schufelt both scored two goals. Alex Canzone and Todd Durantini and Henry Callahan all scored one goal each. Alex Canzone, Aaron Marcourt, Duel Alvarez, Caleb Tedesco, Garrett O'Donnell, and Dominic Caruana all had an assist. The volleyball team last beat Baldwinsville last night, three to nothing. The Spartans were led by seniors Aiden Betts and Jack Franklin. Benz recorded a team high 10 kills and four aces. Franklin posted 25 assists and junior Cole Thomas added nine kills. In the NFL last night, the Cincinnati Bengals beat the Jacksonville Jaguars 24 to 21 on a game winning field goal. Quarterback Joe Burrow threw for 328 yards and two touchdowns, both of which going to receiver CJ Uzama, who had 95 yards along with two touchdowns on the night. Some fantasy wire, waiver, wire waivers that you can pick up tonight are Derek Carr, DJ Moore, and the Titans defense. In upcoming games, the football team has their homecoming game tonight against CBA at 6.30. The gymnastics team has a meet tomorrow at Valley against Proctor at 1. Boys soccer plays Baldwinsville tomorrow at 1.30. And I'm Tanner with your sports. Well, ESN, that's all we have for today, so have a great last day of Spirit Week. And we'll see you at the pep rally. Okay, bye. Okay, bye.